Hi. Um, do you guys repair hard drives? Yes. Need to get this repaired. Okay. That was the sketchiest. Okay, whatever that was, do not bring your hard drive there. Well, the first spot I went to was the sketchiest place ever. This place has got some good ratings and actually talked to somebody who knows what they're talking about. So let's see what happens here. Well, the place was a lot more professional, but um didn't really yeah. accomplish anything yeah they said that they would send it out to a third party which i could just do by myself so um i think i'm just gonna end up using seagate the scary part about this whole thing is that there are dozens upon dozens of companies that repair these things like it's like there's a business for a product that doesn't work like it's crazy I mean, I don't, I don't know what to say. So I'm gonna call Seagate up right now. I wasn't very nice to them this morning because screw Seagate, but um, yeah. Seagate is a company that owns this company, which is a shock, right? That's the drive that John's went bad. And I guess it's a pretty common thing, like 70% of drives fail, so that's good. Okay, uh, for a single drive, which I'm assuming that you have a single drive. Yeah, it's a one terabyte. We have two options. Okay, we have two options. We have the $599 and we have the $699 flat rate. That's the total price. Perfect. Uh, if, That's if beautiful. You agree, uh, if you agree with the process, you'll be paying uh, $49, no refundable evaluation fee. Uh, in case the recovery is not successful for any reason, that will be the only charge, which is $49. The first option will be uploading the data to the cloud. Oh yeah, no, uh, I don't want to. So I'll have to download a, a, tig a terabyte of data? Yeah, that's the, the, yeah, the no. first option. No, 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 no first option. We're going to do second option. Okay. Yeah, for the second option, you will receive a replacement, uh, I mean, a, a four terabyte drive with your data on it. And if your original drive is still under warranty, you will receive a second replacement drive. Okay, and then what if what if by the time that drive, since these drives suck, what if by the time that drive gets to me and I can't get the data off it because it, it malfunctions again? Because there's like a 70% failure rate on these drives, I guess. So will you guys repair it? Will you repair that one for free or will, will, what's the deal on that? Uh, we keep uh, we keep the, the, the data for 45 days after we ship it back to customers. Okay, so 45 days, yeah. Have that's yeah, a good that's a that's a very good idea you guys have because your drives just fail like all the time so that's a good idea now you guys are thinking well that's just for the data recovery process oh, this yeah. is not related to the warranty or anything so I know. Yeah. whenever you got your data back you can back it up yeah oh yeah i'm gonna I'm back that thing up that thing will be backed up on 10 drives it'll be backed up so much i won't even know what to do with it so um well, where do we start? Where do I send this thing? Are you guys going to send me an email or how uh, does this work? I can send you an email right now since I have your account with all the information you might need as well as the submission form. Beautiful. You have a great day, sir. You too. You have a nice day as well. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> Seagate, you're just so you're just so kind. You're just so kind. Hey, well, you know, I'm gonna go buy a Ford truck now, and I'm gonna buy a second one just in case it fails. You know, you gotta have two trucks just in case your drive fails. Huh? Ready to go rip some lips? Yeah, let's go in the rain. That's good filming weather right here. Yeah. How you been? I've been good. Better than you. Any hard drives go bad? No. No? But I also don't sit on footage. Oh, I'm sorry. You're at... Did you go stay on an island for three days? Well, guys, the beginning of this video was kind of a little confusing, but if you haven't, if you didn't know, I am dealing with a hard drive that went bad. I lost all of my footage. Um, I don't... Are you peeing? No. What? What? What?
Why would you pee right there? I went in the dark. I had to go. Well, why didn't you like go around the house or something? So, I, like I said, there was a lap. I had a video. I have the last video. I actually only have half of the last video. Uh, we forgot that we transported some of the footage. So, I honestly have no videos from the trip. I posted both the muskies that I caught up on my Instagram. So, go check that out. Alex Peric one. But they're saying three weeks, 80% chance that I get my stuff back. On that note, I'm done talking about it. I know I kind of overreacted a little bit in the live stream. I'm just, I'm so passionate about this and just so... I have such a hot head sometimes that you guys know this. I put it in my videos. I don't. That's who I am. Anyways, all that being said, we finally figured it out after going to three different places, calling up Seagate four times, and uh, yeah, we're going to drop it off in the mail again tomorrow. But it is now time. Chris and I were supposed to fish tonight. Are we going to fish tonight or no? Why do you keep pointing the camera at me? Because <laughs> I feel like you, you point just... the camera at me always for the most obvious questions. Like, there's only an hour left of sun and it's pouring rain. Hey, Chris, are we fishing tonight? No. So I guess we're not fishing tonight. We are actually going to load this boat up and uh, we are going to head out of here. All this hard drive stuff, I took a couple days off from actually filming. I'm actually back at it. And Chris and I have no clue where we're going. But when I was taking that break, I did fish a tournament and I didn't want to share it with you guys. Well, I didn't really film because I was so mad about the hard drive. I put the cameras away, at least the big camera. I just set up the GoPro. And right now I'm gonna play a couple clips from that tournament. Jesus. Are you peeing? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, giants. How fat that is. We had some fatties and some peanuts. That's two. Yeah, what'd you get them on? Shiner bait? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you didn't catch a catfish on that thing? Uh-uh. 1077. We ended up weighing in about 12 or 11 pounds, actually, and coming in like fourth. All that being said, we fished that tournament just for fun, so it's not like a big problem that I don't have the footage. Okay. Oh, look at this guy. Yo, what's going on? He works for Mystery Tackle Box. Yo, what's going on? He does. What's yeah, up? What's How up? are you? How Sam. You Chris, good to what's meet What's going you? on? What's oh, going you're on? you're the intern. Yeah. He's tall. What are you doing yeah. here? Um, it was actually my birthday a couple days ago, oh, and I got birthday. a Bass Pro uh, gift card. Gift card. There you go. To out, so. You going fishing this weekend? Um, I'm actually going to South Carolina. South my, Carolina. To gotcha. see my girlfriend, but yeah, I wish. You wish. How embarrassing was that? That was hilarious. That wasn't embarrassing. How are you going to get embarrassed by that? That's you. That's just another parrot moment. <laughs> I legit walked into a wall. <laughs> the best part is that lady behind the counter, you know, when we were walking in, she was like, yeah. you filming a documentary? Yeah, yeah. The second you did that, she just like had the like the funniest like grandma smirk on her face. She was laughing. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I want to keep you guys hanging. I want to keep some suspense up. So hopefully you guys tune in for tomorrow's video. I appreciate all of you guys and uh, all the nice comments on that video where I lost my hard drive do mean a lot to me because as you guys could tell it did affect me but thank you guys so much we'll see you guys tomorrow and uh, hopefully we're catching big muskies or big bass or doing something fun.